Hey everybody, so I've got another unboxing video for you. This one's going to be the Caroline Istmus. I think that's your pronounce it. I've, I've always got that name wrong, so I've been trying to figure out is that the way you say it or not. So if then let me know in the comments if anybody, if I've said it wrong or something. But I'm um, Finnish heavy metal band that were formed in 1990, so a bit of the backstory. They were obviously from Finland in 1990. Um, they've Mixed quite a few genres in their music over the years, so like Melodeath, Prog, Folk, um, Death Doom, etc. But the current stuff is more f um, progressive. Um, debut album was this was their debut album released in 1992. I've actually played the hell out of this album and I love it. The only reason I got this edition because you get privilege of Evil EP on the end, which I thought was awesome. So I don't have to get the EP, but I still want to get a copy and actually find it. The only downside is some of these is when you get the on the corner there them stickers which or the thing which is a bit of a, a pain when trying to get the case open because it actually says on the thing the sticker of what it is but um i've got a few where i've kept them sealed purely because it actually says the name of the um artist and whatnot on that sticker so i thought i'm keeping it purely sealed purely because of that and i've gone out and bought another copy but i'm um, Stuff like this, trying to get it open, is a bit of a ball ache when you're trying to get the case open without damaging it. There we go. Let me peel the rest of that off. And then we'll get into this. <coughs> so there's the iconic artwork and in the back with the um, track listing for the album and the EP. This one, Relapse Records, awesome. So I'll be adding, the moment I've done this, I'll be actually playing this um, CD. So I'll be giving it a, this one a listen. So let me show you the disc. There you go. Actually wearing a Under the Red Cloud hoodie, which is my favourite Amorphous album, which I think is incredible. And um, my actually favourite um, Amorphous song is Dark Path, which is awesome. But um, I do like Alone, which I know is a different vocalist because I was... Over the years, I've been through various lineup changes. So there's the inlay. I'll show you the book in a moment. They've gone through quite a few lineup changes um, with singers and whatnot, which um is a can be a bit annoying when there's um they go through like several singers and stuff like that. But this is probably going to be short this video. But there's some cool artwork, and then it opens up to all the pictures of the should I say the lyrics. And it shows you the privilege of evil, which is cool. And it actually tells you the lineup from that era. So you get, um, where is it? Tommy Koivasari, I think that's how you pronounce it. Vocals, guitar, six string acoustic guitar. Essa Halapainen is one of the original members. Guitar, 12 string acoustic guitar, because Thomas. Because um, Essie Halepain is still in the band. Oli, Pekka, Lane, bass. Jan, Riff, Berger, drums and keyboard. So I'm not sure if Essie Halepain is the founding member. Or is he one of the original. But he's been in it from the start. So I need to do a bit more research on the band. So I'll know a bit more about the history. Because <coughs> I probably don't know as much as some people. So yeah, this has been Amorphis. The Cavalier Istamus with um privilege of evil ep as bonus so i'm gonna go and play this now which i can't wait to play it again <coughs> so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video i will put a link in the description <coughs> for somebody to save the artwork or anything like that or the name or the genre of peach you interest then i do highly recommend seeing these <coughs> checking them out i've actually seen these once and i've seen them on the under the red cloud tour in wolverhampton and they were absolutely fantastic. The only thing was the um the support bands were just like localish bands, and um they wasn't too good. If I'm right, the two of the support bands that played, they wasn't that good. So um sounding, but Amorphis were incredible, and they played quite a lot off the um <coughs> under the red cloud purely because it was the under the red cloud tour. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new to this channel, please remember to like and subscribe, hit that notification bell, and all that sort of good stuff. Because I do unboxing videos, show off my collection, share the love of my music, um, album reviews, gig reviews, latest haul and that sort of good stuff and show off tattoos and everything. So 
Hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll catch you in the next video. So take care. Stay safe.